Hi everybody, welcome back. Um, hope everybody is in good form. So this week we're going to do like a really, really nice natural look. It's kind of like a universal makeup look. It's an everyday look that will suit all skin types and all age groups. So all you have to do is keep watching. And just to let you know that this, um, this video is sponsored by Sligo Leader Partnership and the SICAP. So um, stay tuned. So I'm going to start off and I'm just going to clip my hair just out of the way here. I can actually see what I'm doing. So I'm starting off with the foundation. I'm using Estee, or I'm using um, Charlotte Tilbury, the Flawless Finish, and it's a really nice foundation. You can use whatever you have. I'm using the Blank Canvas, the F20 foundation brush. I'm applying a little bit of product to my foundation brush. You really don't need much. And I'm starting down the center of the nose because that's where you need the concentrated color. So I'm sort of dabbing this into the skin. I'm evening out my skin tone and I'm not applying too much product because I still want to be able to see my skin. And then I'm coming up through the hairline and I'm buffing that really, really well into the forehead. And again, coming out to the ears, pulling out the ears and I'm working down. So you can just see that that's starting to even out the skin tone. I'm sorry, the light is changing here now. So again, you're just buffing really, really well. And you're just keeping it nice and soft. And you can always go back for more foundation if you feel you need it. But with this foundation, less is more. You really don't need a whole pile. So that is your foundation. So next up, I am going to use um, a little contour stick. And this just adds a little bit of definition to the face and it sort of slims the cheeks. So I'm starting back here and I'm buffing this. This is a cream contour. So I'm gonna show you how to do cream and how to do um, powder. So this just warms up the face. So you can just apply a little here and here. So I've already prepped the skin, as I was saying. I have um, cleansed, toned and moisturized. And I have used um, a little serum as well, just to set the makeup in place. So that's basically your base. So next up, I'm going to use um, a little highlighter. And I'm using this nice and high up on the cheeks. So now that we have our base done, I'm just going to show you how to contour the skin. So I'm going to be using this little palette. This is the Be Bold palette. So with this fella here, I'm going to get an angled brush, top off the excess, and I'm start back at my ear, and I'm coming right into the corner of the eye, round and circular motions. And again, this just adds structure to the face. You can come right up around the forehead. Same here. A little bit around the jawline, structure the face. So you can just see that warming up the cheeks and it's just giving definition to the face. Next up, I'm going to use a little bit of the Carter Beauty. I love this little palette. Just a little bit of the blusher. I love blusher. So again, just nice and high on the cheekbones. a little bit into the sockets of the eyes and again I'm just going to use a little bit of the highlight so with my um, F28 blank canvas brush I'm just using a little bit of highlighter there and just see that how it's just starting to catch the light 
on the same the side. And then down the nose, a little bit in the center of the forehead, on the tops of the lips, the cupid's bow. So that is your perfect base. And that just gives a nice definition to the skin. It's just so easy for everybody to use. It just wakes up your face and makes you look alive. Um, so for the for the lips, I'm going to use um, a little, um, what is this, Rimmel. And it's number 47. So what I'm doing is outlining the cupid's bow. 